Hi, welcome to the Ambition video series. Today we will be walking through how to do a mass user upload via CSV and properly format your CSV. This is a great way to speed up your onboarding process or quickly add new users as they join Ambition. Let's begin at our dashboard and direct to the left-hand navigation to get to Administration, People, Users. This will bring you to your user directory. At the top of your screen, click the Add New User tab. This is where you will add new users to your Ambition instance via CSV or manual upload. As you see here, you can input a single user and optionally add them to memberships and apply permissions. Before clicking Create User, you have the option to check Invite upon creation. I typically leave this box unchecked so that I can invite users once I'm ready. If you scroll back to the top and click the drop down box to select Upload Users, you will be redirected to where we upload users via CSV. Before we upload our CSV, we want to make sure it is properly formatted. In our sheet, I have included the three required columns shown here. Notice how my users have different email addresses. If you are integrating data outside of Salesforce and are using email as the unique identifier, make sure you choose the most reliable email address. For more information on data integration, click on the link in the video description below. Next, we see some optional columns and it looks like I have accidentally left the is manager column blank. If I were to upload this file now, I would receive an error message in Ambition and be unable to upload. So we will go ahead and add Katie and Terry's permissions. I want to give Terry the permission to be a manager by typing true into his cell. Oops, it looks like Google converted true to a Boolean. We want this to be plain text so that Ambition can process it. I'll go ahead and highlight the cells under is manager and click format number, then click plain text. Next, I'm going to go ahead and retype true so that it is no longer capitalized and add false for Katie. Time zones also need to be formatted as US slash Eastern instead of just Eastern. A list of database time zones is given in the description. Now that I have my file ready, I will need to download it as a CSV by going to File, Download As, comma Separated Value. Finally, I can come back to Ambition to upload my CSV. If it uploads successfully, Ambition will notify you at the bottom of the screen. Next, we will make sure our CSV fields are mapping to the correct Ambition fields. Note that I used pre-made group types for my memberships. Role, location, and team were previously set up so they will show in the drop-down menu. Once I have checked these fields, I will click Create Update to Users. Ambition notifies us that it was a success. Let's go back to the Directory tab to make sure these were uploaded. I'm going to search for Katie in the search bar. There she is. It looks like she has three issues with her account. Click on the Edit icon and Ambition will display these issues at the top of the page. These tell us that we still haven't invited Katie to Ambition and we also haven't set up her integration IDs. You can see here that Katie did not get flagged as a manager. Her time zone is correct and she was placed into the correct group memberships. Katie is good to go, so I will click the back button. Now that I am ready to invite users, I am going to filter these users down to who has not been invited yet. Then click on the green Actions button where I can invite all 15 inactive users, email users, or download a CSV with the users I just filtered to. We could also filter down to all users within the Feisty Sharks team. We could then send this selected group an email or download them as a CSV. If you would like to update users from a downloaded CSV, please click on the link in the description. 
This concludes the user upload section of our Ambition video series. For further information, check out our help documentation at zendesk.ambition.com or contact us at gethelp.ambition.com.